Uh, what's up folks, I'm Daily Fix. welcome to the uh, the second part of the uh, the mission here. I will be saving every now and then because this is actually the third time um, we need to do this again, so here we go. The wreck. Your escort is ready and eager for a fight. Let's go. Bit further. Xenon, dispatch them, operative. M. Sorry about that. Uh, I'll send you the bill. M. Second. Yeah, I'm thinking this is working M. a bit more in my advantage. Because the turrets are attacking my target. M. I'm going to enjoy sending you to the scrap Not bad for machine, I Okay, few more remaining. Four by the looks of it. Okay, these Maelstrom as turrets, they do a wonderful job, but I just don't want to have them as my main weapons. Okay, and finally, the last one remaining. Oh yeah, way better than last time. I'd love to take the time to commend you for your bravery, Operative, but I'm afraid you'll have to continue on your quest right away. A local trader just sent out a distress signal, and the pattern matches that of an earlier pirate attack. We're close to apprehending these intruders. Okay, so after the trader, we will save. Yeah, that was that was actually not bad. Um, on my target, definitely works. If um, autopilot disengaged, if we can take down the main enemy as fast as the other ones, which won't happen because he's fighting in a medium ship, then uh, I would say we're pretty much uh, solid. Yeah, it, it is really way easier. Maybe I should do a young gun uh, attempt at some point. You know, when I'm, I'm sick and tired of the Terrans. Because, like I said, I, I like building, I like the logistical chain of things. And unfortunately, the Terrans, they lack a lot. Once again, my... Autopilot is ruining it. Just bypassing it, mate. Fine. So, have you ever done a um, a galactic conquest? Entering Uranus. It's possible. Uh, I'm 
Galactic, nah, too busy. Oh, you make mega stations? I heard the, uh, the mega stations aren't the best idea. But then again. Oh, there we go. That's good news. We go um, pause it for a second. Medium ship is done. He can now go satellite. Satellite. Drop one over there. Satellite. And then fly and wait over there. He actually destroyed. He's gone, right? Good. I don't mind. Let's go. Ooh, really? And you must have been really going at you you lose uh, large mining ships then i think it's there okinawa seems you've arrived just in time the reports are piling up in pioneers territory as we feared Never bankrupt a uh, a system before. <laughs> that sounds really good. Damn. The Terrans there always lied on silicon, it seems, so... Okay. Let's do it right this time. How odd. The trader reports that she was ordered to drop her cargo, but that nothing of value ended up being stolen. Only a small amount of foodstuffs. However, there's no time to dwell on that right now. This is as far as I can safely communicate with you, Operative. From here on out, you're on your own. Okay. No, that's that's so cute to save. Well, they they can use drones, right? The large mining ships. The mining drones or something like that. So I think that would be way better. Could be me. <clears throat> because it's 5 a.m. then. <laughs> Which is way too late and we need to kill that first guy because he has the best weapons yeah the peas are yeah they're this one now that the venerable terran individual has terminated communications i can finally share my insights with my valued assistant i do so fancy a scientific investigation Okay. Accelerator, Neptune. This ship can't do jack. Come on. If we focus on the peas. <laughs> uh. And then work our way up. Yeah, I agree. Uh, we can use the pause button as well. 
so we can select the target. Empty entering Neptune. If they use boost mode, that will definitely ruin their shields. I spot a pioneer mining fleet in the distance. Maybe we can ask them for directions. Bolo, mineral. Let, let's hawk the, um, the enemy ship, like from the rear. So we can actually do a massive volley, volley of, of damage to him. Once he's gone selecting targets, they will attack them. Ukri, Bolo, Mineral. Well, here we go again. By the Queen! Those pioneer fellows seem to be in trouble. Oh, Treads there! One step closer, and your space fly yeah. down! No, no, no! This can't be happening! Fleet, defend yourself. Don't let that Yaki take away our hard earned credits. Captain? Are you sure? Of course I am. We're pioneers, and we won't be done in by a pirate. Oh, I will see water for this. This one is an N. Boss. Uh, this one is an N. That one as M. well. Let's see. That one. one we got two more ends uh, three more ends That pause button, amazing. That's a P. Two more ships remain. P first. Oh, he's, he's trying to get away. Incoming missile. Danger. Okay, last one. <laughs> so much more. Okay, guys, if you're struggling with this mission, use the pause button.
Actually, this B is very annoying due to the missiles. There you go. Oh, that was a close one. Now, friend, I don't know how to thank you. Arrived at precisely the right moment. <laughs> I don't know if we would have found the courage to stand up against that vile fiend. Sure you do, mate. But Captain Atreides. Reuven, please. Give our guest a moment to breathe. <sighs> Maybe collecting the cargo that was scattered during this most <laughs> heinous attack will help lift our spirits, yes? Please, friend, give us a hand if you will. Splendid. Please, friend, do accompany us on our journey. It is just a short hop. Upon our arrival, I will arrange for you to be generously accommodated. Yeah, I don't, I don't for, uh, trust this guy whatsoever, of course, but... Please, friend. Please, friend. Ah, oh, man, say that too many times and people will distrust you. And we won't be attacked. Um, I, um, I'm using a, uh, a DLC or a mod, which is the, uh, fly by looting. I don't have to press O anymore. So if we look in here, there should not be any loot and we got everything. Oh, it's very handy. Um, I've made like three million in very early Say, missions. Friend, what leads you to this most remote of places? Perhaps you've heard of the famous Pioneers Initiative and couldn't help but want to see this most honorable endeavor for yourself. I can proudly say that us Pioneers have dutifully expanded the reaches of Sol ever since our inception and our glorious tale grows grander by the day. Just tell me where you're going, dude. This operation is rather fascinating. A boron. How intriguing. You couldn't possibly be here because of the planetary beautification program? Oh, indeed. I have a plethora of vivid ideas that I would very much like to... I mean, that information is classified. Friend? Right. Too many ears. Well... I'm sure we'll have ample opportunity for a chat once we arrive at our destination, my dear friends. Yeah, we're going to the Bernard Triumph. Can we just go there ourselves? Follow this guy? Come on, man. Just keep flying. Entering system. Brennan's Triumph. Captain, oh. we're approaching our base of operations. Please. Oh, there we go. Autopilot. Oh. Engaged. Capital. Well then, my friend, you go and take the cargo you helped us collect to the customs officer. Oh, over well, I've been around. Don't worry. Uh, I've been around a bit. And you'll get your share. Once we get in here, activate this choice of usually I just get one from over here actually. I love how they built this. Docking granted. Yeah. I got my first ones just from the. I'm um, from killing the Xenons. Docking permission granted. Oh, I'm so happy that this is finally done. This entire situation appears to be rather opaque. I do hope that this customs officer will be able to shed some light on what we just witnessed.
Yeah, true. It, it's easy money though if you start. We'll fail in this shot. Uh, yes. How can I help you? Let's uh, go to five. Ah, uh, yes. I've been expecting another delivery. One shipment of Terran Tech unloaded and ready for sampling. Few of these crates are damaged. That's a bit troubling. You wouldn't know anything about that, now would you? Hmm. True, but you can't keep going overboard. I know how much this operation means to all of you, but if Protectorate citizens keep getting hurt, that'll put us all in danger. Here, take this as a token of thanks, and maybe tell Atreides not to oh, overdo it. There we go. Damaged Singularity Engine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll make sure to tell him that. Thank you. Finally, <clears throat> someone who's reasonable. It is um, very likely that I got I'm all of my I items in my own station. We may have to investigate further. The denizens of the local recreation establishment will surely be able to elaborate. Trust me, assistant, for I have done my research on proper detective work. Yeah, there we go. Let's craft the Seda. Can make some space bombs as well. Yeah. He needs new hobbies, that's for sure. Okay, let's go to the others. Let's go to the bar. Stars light upon you. My people are spread far, and I consider it my holy duty to travel the gate network and give spiritual guidance to those in need. One day, these pioneers will perceive that their work is guided by the sacred geometry of the cosmos that shaped us all. However, I have realized with great regret that not even my parinid brethren among the scientific elite can spare the time for my counsel. Truly a tragic display of hubris. I had no choice but to withdraw to this humble place so that I may meditate and resume my service among the lowest of the low. Wow. Really? Resume my service of the lowest of the low? These people desperately need someone to teach them serenity and contentment. This area of the gate network houses so many disparate peoples, so much potential for strife. And even on this station, there is scarcely a moment of peace. Not so long ago, I observed a pilot with a terribly asymmetrical face storm through these serene halls, assailing innocent bystanders. It would truly be a shame if this budding community were to wither in senseless conflict. Good day to you. Weirdo. Absolute weirdo. <coughs> Hello there, pilot. End up here. I was with the pioneers from the very start. Well, almost. Mining rights were difficult to come by back in those days. And if you're just some odd jobber on the edges of Sol, uh, the well-oiled machine of the Terran protectorate economy treats you like space dust. No offense, by the way. Don't know if you're affiliated, but you did meet up with us coming from that direction. <laughs> Does she now? Gah, the gall of the woman. She's the one who got us into that situation in the first place. Oh, I'll tell her a story, all right, when I next meet her. Uh, nothing in particular. Uh, you know, the usual dangers of long-distance hauling. Uh, I mean, mining. Yes. Don't concern yourself with that. Right now, all is well. And you're our honoured guest. <sighs> Enjoy your stay. Let's go talk to um, this weird person. Hello there. Oh, I'm just working for the captain over there. It's a well-paying job, all things considered. Especially with all the pirate attacks recently yeah about that you do realize that we're professionals right that we've probably dealt with pirates in the past that situation could have gone a lot worse 
But it also could have gone a whole lot better if we'd made even the slightest effort to de-escalate. Look, I'm glad you came to help us out. But next time, try to read the situation first. Should probably tell that to the captain, too. I, I, I really like the ships and buildings, actually, from the pyramids. Greetings, fellow pioneer. I am on a trade mission for the local branch of the Teladi Company. If things go well, I may soon call myself CEO of the Ugaras Foundation, purveyor of progress and business partner of the Sigaras Pioneers. Independence is truly one of the greatest catalysts for profit. Hmm. Everyone here is so secretive. It feels as if I am constantly walking on eggshells. That customs officer is the worst of the entire clutch. If you miss one small bit of the customs code and answer in the wrong fashion, you suddenly find yourself left outside and a deal is short. He's so pissed. Have you heard that certain sensory impressions can trigger memories? For me, personally, it is the sight of my credit balance increasing. I, I like the Taladi in that sense. Don't like the stations a lot. Profits, do you? Hello there. Hello there, pilot. And she told you that. You two must be getting rather close already. Look, I'm not saying she's wrong. I know I jumped the gun. Might have endangered the entire operation. I'm sorry I misjudged you. I simply saw a ship I didn't know arriving at that crucial moment and tried my best to keep up appearances. But I know that doesn't change anything. I should maybe just stay away from Shani for a while. I would... A very long while. Uh, let's not go Enjoy there Enjoy your stay. <clears throat> Hello there. Stars light upon you. Good day to you. I guess we'll have to reveal that we are working Hello for him. Hello there, pilot. No, I'm innocent, I swear. That customs officer has been in cahoots with those pirates this entire time. <clears throat> I wouldn't be surprised if she was a Yaki herself. Mm. You disgust me, Atreides. We made a promise. I'm only telling the truth, Reuven. <laughs> I keep telling you that we can't stand up to the Protectorate. Please don't tell your superiors. Apprehend that customs officer, and this entire mess will be cleaned up, I promise. Damn it. Reuven, what? Praise miscommunication, as our new parent and friend might say. Onward. I have marked the customs office for you. Yeah. Ah, long live the protectorate. Or protectorate. <laughs> oh no! The tadpole has jumped the pond. Hurry up, assistant. The Our tadpole. investigation demands the but It reminds case. me of Baldur's Gate. <laughs> I should just do this. Get off Katana. my seat. Hello there. Hey, go away.
maintenance vessel. Yeah. Oh, that is really nice and very dangerous. Rapier. Okay, let's um, put these on defend. That asteroid does look peculiarly inhabited or abandoned. Well, I'm Dutch, it so English is my second language. Resolution. But I do advise caution, and there is the customs officer again. Do not spook her. We still have to find the clue. The clue. You, stop right there. Judging oh, by she's dead. reactions to your rather forceful negotiation. Thanks for your help. What do you want? Are you threatening me? I have no further business with you. Um. Thank you for letting me know. Maybe it's for the best. Towards the end, he was a danger to himself and everyone around him. Oh, this is Shani. <gasps> oh, she's from the first mission. We might have been once. It's true, <clears throat> by the way. He came to me quite recently. Went on and on about this new piece of cyberware he built out of Terran high tech. He was so proud. And of course, he wanted me to have it. Thought that it would make me reconsider my decision and maybe go back with him. He was already so far gone. I couldn't bring myself to say no, and so I took it. Kept it with me even though I knew I'd never return there. Here, I'll make you an offer. You seem more sensible than I expected, and I have a feeling that you wouldn't stop searching just because I told you to get lost. You go ahead and take this. See where it leads you. All I ask of you is to keep an open mind and don't judge a book by its cover. There are going to be a few ugly ones where you're headed. Oh, Good luck. I bet. An item. How curious. Container. This appears to be a rather advanced piece of cybernetics. Ooh. Its creator Ooh. seems to have poured his very soul <clears throat> into the intricate metalwork. And if my eyes do not mislead me, yes. It appears to be linked to the scary and sinister asteroid in your vicinity. Assistant, I command you to investigate. I love that he commands everyone. Let's uh, look for the way in. Let's see if it's over here. I think it, this is the entrance or the exit. Yeah, I think we want to do this in our spacesuit. Ah. Let's take the elevator. Katana. You can fly a ship in, but eventually you will get stuck. So, this katana can now go... Dock and wait over there. Uh, once we um, actually get the ship inside, I think that is a very good wrapping off point again for a very long episode. As well as a very long day for me. Since it's now almost 5am. I can feel this place watching me. I suggest we conclude our investigation in the most efficacious and hasty manner possible.
Okay. One thing I'll do here is save. I don't I think these are mines. And and I don't want to test out if I'm right. <laughs> For some real old reason I, I kinda don't want to blow up. Can you imagine? Okay, let's go. Now I don't have to be that careful. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're mines. I remember going through these the very first time. I was so I damn scared. Like the look of that. An abandoned Yaki ship. So this is what that awfully suspicious customs officer was hiding. I don't need to claim it, I'm already inside. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go backwards. A bit. There you go. I got stuck in here as well, um, but I, I just got out of the ship and the autopilot was able to, you know, get it back. There you go, there's the exit. I know. Ingenuity is my name. There you go. Ah, oh, these weapons are quite cool. So here we go, guys. We got ourselves a uh, a new ship to play around with, uh, leaving the abandoned asteroid behind. There appeared to be multiple options at your disposal, Assistant. From what I could gather, your other employer would undoubtedly appreciate your swift return. However, those overzealous Terrans will likely quarantine this marvelous piece of technology in their enthusiasm. Should you decide to meet them, it would be prudent to not waste resources on ship equipment beforehand. Alternatively, and if I may say so, preferably, you are always welcome to join me at your own headquarters. I do admit that I may not be the most ostentatious or generous of hosts, but I promise not to damage your newly acquired vessel during the examination. The quest for knowledge is the noblest of pursuits. So Greetings, friend. I am proud to announce that we are making great progress in our terraforming endeavors. You will find that our planet Sun, in the Gaian Prophecy System, now harbors a much more hospitable ecosystem. Again, great thanks to you for the part you played in this. Farewell, friend.
Welcome back to the Protectorate, Operative. I see you've made a new acquisition. If you dock it at our headquarters, my team will take it apart and extract all the information relevant to your investigation. Uh, we are. We are. We already have one of these ships. Yeah, I knew. I was absolutely watching chat, just waiting for you to reply on that. Yeah, these frogs are actually doing quite okay. So, yeah, it needs a lot more work. I'm considering getting these um, these baldrics out. Uh, once we um, get protein paste going, I think then that would be the best timing to get these baldrics and start distributing west from over that region. Also, we can make him level 3, um, getting our Baldrix away even further. Entering Saturn. It's just quite possible. I think that's not a bad idea. Can I help? Can I help? Ah, shame. Goodbye. Yeah, man, I'm, uh, I'm going to be offline as well. Um, going to be... You know what? I'll fly there um, off camera. We're not docking the ship. So, yeah, if you've been here watching this, then thank you so much. Um, thank you, Dave. Thank you, Wenak. Thank you, everyone who has been here. I really appreciate it, as always. Hope to see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Docking granted. Successfully docked. Please step out of this monstrosity operative. My team will take it from here. You can be on your way. Docking permission granted. Well. I guess that's that ship. Wonderful. That didn't take long. I'm transmitting the decrypted navigational data to your mission interface. And one more thing. Since you appear to be nearing the final stage of your investigation, I think you should travel in style. It's time to drop the masquerade and display the full force of the Terran Protectorate. You'll find her on the dock. Oh boy. So I'm thinking... Is it another katana? Yeah, it is. Look, because we have the R katana over here. So we just got ourselves a new katana. Hello there. Hello there. Katana. Let's take a look what it has equipped. Uh, not the best. We're definitely not using those weapons. Do it like that. I'm okay with this. Get the best in there. 16 flares. 2.4 million. Another one. But this ship has something special. I believe that this ship can actually use that uh, cloaking ability. So let's put it on the list and confirm that. Two minutes. Uh, anyways, that's it. That's what I wanted to show you. And uh, let's get up, see what the mission is about. We're definitely not going... Yeah, we should start doing this one. Investigate at Advitvas by policy. Or going to distant shores. Yeah. We need to do distant shores. 
uh, it's going to be a lot of finding um, and we'll actually head over in a system over here but that's fine that's something for next time guys i just want to show you this one bye bye